there's really no safe like Simply Safe. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I'm in Washington, D.C. today, which is kind of fun. I also arrived at around 11.30 last night. It is 6.30 in the morning. It was a last minute trip. I got invited out to the White House from the White House to look at their holiday decorations, the unveiling of the holiday decor at the White House. And I was like, you know what? We're going, I'm going to be sharing it with you here on the channel. And I figured this is a once in a lifetime opportunity to go to the White House and I have to document it. Now I thought it would be fun to give kind of a brief history lesson on Christmas and Christmas at the White House. So Queen Victoria and Prince Albert were actually shown in the London news in 1848 with a Christmas tree. And that's what kind of started the craze in the United States. But the first known Christmas tree brought into the White House was actually in 1889 during Benjamin Harrison's administration. In 1929, Lady Lou Henry Hoover was the first to actually decorate an official Christmas tree in the Blue Room, and ever since, the First Ladies have carried on the tradition. And in 1961, First Lady Jacqueline Kennedy started the tradition of picking themes for the White House Christmas decorations each year. And in 1961, she actually opted for ornaments and decorations depicting the Nutcracker Sweet Ballet. And ever since, the tradition has stayed the same with the First Lady choosing the style of decor for the year. I got a suit for the occasion. Um, and this one's perfect because look, it literally has like red and green and blue. It's like kind of Christmassy. And then I got this shirt here. I went to Zara super last minute, right before my flight yesterday. And I got this. Come inside. Oh. Oh, that looks chic, Justin. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> Outlet mall. And so I have two tie options. We have this like velvet cranberry raisin color or this plaid, which is kind of fun because there are stripes and plaid in the outfit. I kind of look like, just like corporate. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> so look at me. <laughs> I love it. Finished outfit of the day for the White House, and honestly, we're kind of a little late, so let's go. And rewinding just a little bit back to when I left my house in Los Angeles, I turned on my Simply Safe home security system to just make sure that my home and all of my belongings stayed safe while I was in Washington, D.C. And I have raved many times about how much I love my Simply Safe home security system because it really is such an easy system to set up. It's shipped directly to your doorstep in a box. And not to mention the design of this home security system is really sleek and modern. I just love how it fits and pairs with any style of home decor. This is a base station here and it just sets up so easily to the app and genuinely you can have it set up in 45 minutes to an hour especially during the busy holiday season i know we don't have a ton of time so setting this up is quick and easy but it will give you peace of mind especially during this busy gifting season with getting so many packages traveling being out of your home and visiting family for christmas and they have absolutely every single sensor and monitor for all your different doors all your windows and entries including hd cameras both indoor and outdoor and with their 24 7 lifeguard protection only from simply safe professional home monitoring agents will actually be able to speak to intruders in your home, helping to stop crime in real time. And unlike normal home security systems, Simply Safe never locks you into a long-term contract or charges any hidden fees. And professional monitoring plans are available for less than a dollar a day. So definitely take advantage of my incredible offer. They're offering you up to 50% off your Simply Safe home security system when you sign up for Fast Protect Monitoring. How cold is that, would you say? Oh my gosh, look how pretty! That looks like autumn! It's such a pretty day today. greeted by this really big tree that's sticking out the top of the building and going underneath the White House, which is so stunning. And I love this. They actually mentioned that the concept of this was kind of to be child-esque and being underneath the Christmas tree and what the experience of that would kind of be like. And as you got inside, it looked like this. There were so many bright colors, all the candy elements. It was really fun. Thank you so we're much. going to tour the White that. House right now. This year's theme is the magic, wonder, and joy of the holidays. Look how stunning this tree is. 
Oh, so beautiful. And they said that this tree crafted out of wood, all the different elements. So beautiful. I just love the colors. Very me. Look at this candy cane lane. Wow, this is so beautiful. They're playing music at the end. This is so magical, you guys. was just such a surreal feeling being in such a grand space and honestly I was staring at all of the artwork and wallpaper and curtains and mantles. I was looking at every little detail of these rooms because I was trying to take in everything. I wish I could have filmed more honestly but we were here for just an hour so I tried to capture just as much as I was possibly able to and give you all of course some inspiration for the holidays and take you along on such a unique and cool experience. Now this room here look how bright this pink paint color is. It was, I mean, it was beyond. I don't know if it's wallpaper or paint, but it was so bold, so bright, but it still had this kind of like subdued, like moody feeling to it. Loved it. All the art on the wall, these oil paintings. Oh my gosh. The Christmas decor. I loved all of it. Now this room here, I really loved the carpet in here. And then look at this oil painting of Abraham Lincoln above the fireplace. Are you kidding me? Christmas queen, Christmas queen. And DIY king, <laughs> so I'm just saying, it's like a, a combination made in heaven, and we've been having such a good time. I know, and right? Rebecca and I have messaged before, and we've never met in person, so it's so nice. We walk, I walked in this morning, and she was standing right there through the window, and I was like, wait, what? And yes, and you guys, you have to check out Rebecca's Christmas videos. If you need Christmas inspiration, her channel is like so good. She does like the best Christmas decor, Thank and you, you do like multiple different styles, always change it up, right? Every year it's Yeah, different. that's yeah. what I love. I love watching your Christmas videos because they're like really good, you guys. You have to go out to check them out. I'm super proud of him. I feel like he's like <laughs> my son. And uh, I'm the OG on YouTube, and he's the. What I, I've you been be watching you for a long time, like definitely since when I started my YouTube channel, for sure. And how long has that been? Um, Lone Fox. Well, no, I've only had the Lone Fox channel for like four, mm. four and a half, five. Okay. But I've been on YouTube for so like. So you were 10. checking out the competition. Yes, That's I was looking me. for competition. Mm. Right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So fun to be here. Oh, oh, it's an honor. Bye. Yay. Bye. And that was my experience visiting the White House and seeing the unveiling of the holiday decor, which was such a cool and unique experience. I just truly cannot believe that was not a spam email still. This is a little look at the front of the White House, what we were able to capture. And again, thank you so much for watching today's video, and I will catch you in my next one.